New at 10, just when you thought nursing moms were gaining ground, a volleyball coach forced to choose between nursing her infant daughter or coaching her team at the Colorado Convention Center. Denver 7's Lance Hernandez has the fallout. I feel like the message they're sending to these girls is you can't be a mom. And you can't, like, we don't get to be a mom, a coach. I can't have to choose a volleyball or my family, and I shouldn't have to choose that. Dixie Loveless, owner of Mountain Peak Volleyball in Logan, Utah, and head coach of the 14 national team, was told she couldn't bring her infant into the Colorado Convention Center where the team was taking part in a tournament. Tournament director Kay Rogness warned Loveless about the rule this afternoon. The issue is she is under 16. The issue is she is not a player, she is not a coach. Those are the only facts. State law says a mother may breastfeed in any place she has a right to be. We asked the Denver City Attorney's Office about the rule and received this reply. We have no reason to believe there has been a violation of any city ordinance. This is a private event. It is the event organizer and USA Volleyball who set the rules for entry and access to the court area. If we had known this two months ago when we signed up for this tournament, we would have chosen a different tournament because there's lots of qualifiers. To me, it's it's inhumane. State Representative Carrie Tipper, mother of a seven-month-old, says Colorado Crossroads made the wrong decision. It's just a total tone deafness and enraging in 2021 when we saw basketball players nursing their babies at halftime that we're not going to let a mother nurse her baby. We paid money to travel to come do this, and so what I was supposed to do, and they said, Sorry, and they wouldn't give a solution. Dixie stood or sat outside the convention center nursing her infant. Her team won their first game. It was really hard to do it without a coach, our head coach, but we pushed through it and fought for her. And just to play a game without her was definitely different. It was a really weird experience and it was hard. The coach says she's trying to be a role model to every girl at the tournament. I want them to know you can do both. You don't have to just Oh, I have a kid and now I can't do anything. I have to just be a mom. I'm not allowed to go and do other things that other people are, that are not nursing or do not have kids are allowed to do. Lance Hernandez, Denver 7. USA Volleyball reacting with this statement tonight. The organization says, quote, Colorado Crossroads is not operated or controlled by USA Volleyball and its jurisdiction over the event is limited. USA Volleyball has expressed its disagreement with this decision to the tournament director and is encouraging the tournament to reverse the regulation. We just learned that even without their coach by their side, the team did win all three of their matches tonight.